of celebration, but I mean, uh, it's going to be a real good feeling, I'm guessing. Oh, it's amazing. That was incredible. Uh, we've been working for this all year. And, uh, freshman year was the last time that our school got it, so we're definitely excited to come out here and be able to pull off a huge win. Especially as captains to seniors and, you know, doing it the uh, final year, all that kind of thing. Oh, yeah, no, it makes, it makes it that much better. You know, it's our senior nights. This is the last time we get to play on this field, and it was definitely the way we want to go off. Yeah. Yeah, we have uh, high expectations for this team, so uh, this is not our only goal of the season, so we're uh, <laughs> expecting a good battle on Thanksgiving and also in whoever we face in the playoffs, whoever wins the GBL. How will that be for you guys? I mean, just maybe looking ahead a bit. You play on Thanksgiving, but you know you're going to be playing after that. Does it have the same intensity because it's it's still North Andover? You know, you still want to beat them, obviously going to the playoffs on a good note kind of thing? Oh, for sure. We know some of those kids, so... We know we're uh, going to be up against a good team there in a good league this year, so the record may not show uh, what they're capable of. So, yeah. How'd you guys we're playing for the ball. So. You guys what what would you say? Oh, we're playing for the bowl too. We have a little uh, bowl that goes between yeah. us on Thanksgiving. Yeah. So oh, really? It's, yeah. it's important that we win that one. We need that back. We got it last year, and we want to keep it. <laughs> yeah, there you go. How did you guys get off to such a fast start uh, tonight, guys? It seemed like every time you got the ball, it was boom, 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 boom. I think you scored on. Six of your seven possessions, the last one, they're just not scoring. But other than that, you know, everything worked out great. Chris, uh, was the offense, everything just working in sync tonight? I just think that our offense feeds from intensity from everyone. Like our defense, Dylan, the way Dylan hits, everyone feeds off him. The way we hit, like, I don't think we've gotten much credit this season for the way we've hit on defense, the way we've made teams not want to run against us. So it starts on defense? I would say so, yeah. Could you sense that? I mean, you know, when you're in the... Not the trenches so much, but when you're coming up and making a play on somebody, can you feel that they're just like, okay, not tonight kind of thing? Yeah. It's cold. I don't want to get into it. For sure. Yeah. Well, that's what we kind of wanted to bring. We've we've been getting off to kind of slow starts now and then, so we yeah. definitely knew we had to come out fast. And you want to get a team so they don't want to play anymore, and I think that's what we were uh, able to do today. Well, you guys put two big defensive performances back-to-back here the last two weeks. I mean, the six interceptions last week, a couple of interceptions, uh, at least one interception tonight, but obviously uh, the shutout. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, we definitely uh, kind of stick to that motto where uh, defense wins championships, so we know that if they can't score, they can't win, so we just got to keep coming out hard and keep playing, keep pushing around. Was it, was it the game you guys expected tonight? Um, no, of course not. We don't expect a blowout every game, but we expect a hard-fought game, and we expect our team to respond to whatever comes at us. Yeah. Was there anything in particular that seemed to be working well for you guys tonight either, on either side of the ball? I mean, uh, you know, a play that you guys run regularly, but for whatever reason it was just there tonight, you know, trap, belly, uh, the, the counters, anything like that? We didn't really show much of our playbook tonight. We just ran right at them, basically, <clears throat> and they couldn't stop it, so we kept doing it. Yeah, you guys just ran. You guys ran to the inside, and then you ran it just slightly to the outside tonight, pretty much. Yeah, yeah you know our, our line came out firing, and they're a bunch of strong guys. They work a lot in the off season, so you know you hop behind those big guys, and they're moving that line down the field. It just makes it easy to run behind them. Can you single out a few of those guys? <laughs> oh, of course, uh, yeah. fellow captain Pat McNamara. Yeah. Uh, he's always pushing the guys. He's, he's always working big time. And then we got a couple younger guys. Zeagle, I think he squats 400 plus. Yeah, Sean, Sean Antonuccio, he squats 400. He's close to 500 pounds now. Yeah, Jordan, squatting, right? Jordan Balconis, uh, Chief uh, Casey Guerrero. He uh, he recently started playing offensive line about two weeks ago. He hadn't played offensive line since. Casey sophomore. Guerrero. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, Jordan Balconis who uh, has been playing. He came back uh, two or three weeks ago off an MCL tear, and he's been playing amazing. You wouldn't even know he was hurt. Yeah. So the first of uh, hopefully many goals. You you win tonight. You hopefully win next week. You win your playoff game, and then you go to the Super Bowl, and hopefully you win that. I mean, so first of four steps, hopefully, for you guys. Yeah, but we're we're just focusing on this first one right now, you know, and uh, we know most likely we're, I think it might be definite that we're playing Everett, and they're they're not a team that you can really look past (laughs) and kind of say, let's prepare for Barnstable, so we know that we're playing a a really, really good team and a tough team, and, you know, we have NA first, which we got to focus on, so we're trying to, we're taking this definitely one week at a time. I think it says a lot for you guys, though, I mean, for... Mascadon at Regional will be playing Mighty Everett in the playoffs. I mean, that says a whole lot about you guys, I think, too, you know? Yeah. Um, there's not much else to say about it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, it's a tough long. matchup. That's it's, a tough matchup. It's the David Goliath, so hopefully we can pull it off. Yeah, that's, we're excited that's for sure. For it. Yeah. yeah. Guys.